Now they say no more than this. Why? Because now they have sent the gems of weapon that is go to the space. It disclosed thousands of glaciers like they are our legs. When we are living, there is only one black CDC. But there are thousands of glaciers beyond that. And they say beyond that there are so many. The gems of Weber telescope cannot afford those gems. The degrees of Allah are not known but only to Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala. And that's why we are living in a world sometime day when we were kids in school. So at that time, in a big city, there was only one MD. We used to call him MBBS. Here they call them MD. They come to use to buy MDBS, Bachelor of Medicine and Bachelor of Surgery. Yes, and my doctor. He was making a joke that MDBS take it in a light mode, we are not taking it to court of God. That you are inserting a special profession. I'm not. So he himself was a doctor and he said that we are being a professor. So anyhow, there was only one MBBS. He was checking a man from head to toe. For bones, we used to go to him. For flesh, we used to go to him. For most problem, we used to approach him. For eyes, we were going to him. And then specialization started. So from head to toe, they divided the human body in hundreds of portions that this is ENT specialist. And this one is neurosurgeon. And this one is heart specialist. And this is orthopedic surgeon. Even though specialty came here in a specific but very limited portion. So we said that if you get the heart but Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala says, Roma Utikum in a Rashid Aparela. Whatever you may achieve and avail as far as knowledge and expertise is concerned, Roma Utikum in a Rashid Aparela. Even though, in Urdu we say, Hamunjo Kotao de Tehenge, both come out of the Allah And the Kareem from Nati Roma Utikum in a Rashid Aparela. That you have been given regarding knowledge only in the temples. My dear respected brothers and sisters in Islam. Now, let's come to the point. That Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala, He established this world system. And He says, You should live in the heart of the Lord Hasis. And He's the one. Who is covering the day with the darkness of night? Now covering the day with the darkness of night. So what uh, the astronomer says? Now we are at night time. So they went out somewhere from the whole world or still they exist somewhere. Say still exists. Still. Then we are at night time. The day which is lost, they went out of this world somewhere or simply they exist somewhere. They exist somewhere. So it means that day and night are not going anywhere. Sun and moon, they are not going anywhere. But here they disappear, somewhere they appear. So Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala says, you should be there in the heart. He is covering the day with the darkness of night. And then Allah says, in Arabic and English, that's in the meaning of Sariya. They are following one another very swiftly. Swift in a sense. Have you ever felt or sensed any interval or pause in between day and night? 
say, if a hero saving pause will happen, the world will disappear. There is such a disturbed system and laws of physics are to such an extent we are And Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala says in Holy Quran, إِذَا قَطَّ اللَّهِ الَّتِي فَتَرَرَّ النَّاسَ عَلَيْهَا جَمِيعَا لَا تَبُدِيلَ لِخَلْقِ اللَّهِ Now, actually we are living in an advanced world. In an advanced world. And that's why we left our country and we came here to America. Because this country is further more advanced. Yes, none of us has come here to serve the God of Allah, the Deen of Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala. Is there anyone? We can raise his hand. All of us, we came here for all of us. That's not something prohibited or forbidden. But I am talking about the facts and the realities. I am talking about the facts and the realities. He is from my village. Yes. Back home, he has a lot. But he was looking for further more dollars and further more wealth. And he did not blame me for that. Because I didn't come here for dollars. But for I came fortunately and unfortunately my wife was an actor. Yes? Got it? You are listening to me or not? Yes. So as you know, that either you will say bye bye to your wife or you have to. Yes. Got it? Let me tell you, not a joke, a real story one time of Rasulullah Sallallahu Alaihi Wasallam. That is up to you. <laughs> Sisters, please, you are a Muslim. Sisters, please, you are a Muslim. You are here for salam and reward, not for earning any hazab or any guna. And especially when a dog is going on in the light of Quran and Sunnah and you are making noise. So that is not looking good. So you are humbly requested. I am unknown to you and you are unknown to me. I don't know your family even. But the brother here, I think that he was feeling some fear. That's why he was not saying it. And he told me that you should say it. So I did. Yes, everybody is afraid of Roman. Yes, that's so power. So anyhow, my dear respected brothers and sisters, you are not unhappy with the, my talk. <laughs> say loud. Amen. If you are not happy, so I will make dua and say, yeah. huh? yeah. You are happy. So anyhow, I was referring that there is a real story since the time of Rasulullah and the time of Rasulullah sallallahu alayhi wa sallam. All of us, all of us, narrated this hadith. And the first portion of that hadith is almost known to every single Muslim who has learned the religion. In Namaramaru bin Niyat. We quote this hadith. In Namaramaru bin even though hadith is very lengthy, but then one sentence we are quoting. A common layman is quoting there. That in Namaramaru bin Niyat. Wa in Namaribe in Manawa. Wa mankar dhira to hu ilallahi wa rasuli. Wa nidra to hu ilallahi wa rasuli. أو إلى الدنيا يصيبها أو إمرأة يتزوجها فهجرته إلى ما هاجر إليه رواه مسلم أو كما قال عليه الصلاة والسلام في سيرة الأنبياء الحديث. يبقى أكثر من سرنا من الرسول صلى الله عليه وسلم. كل هذه الأحاديث هذه سرنا من الرسول. The speech of the prophet, the wording of the prophet صلى الله عليه وسلم. My dear respected brother and sister in Islam. So Rasulullah sallallahu alayhi wa sallam says inna maramaru bin diya Now this sentence I have written a book On this one sentence I have written almost 30 and 35 pages That what this sentence means inna maramaru bin diya And in how many places Imam Bukhari has narrated this hadith so he has narrated and quoted this hadith in his sahih in seven places in different chapters. And he started his sahih, al-Rukhari, with this hadith. Wa bi qala khadda sana al-Qumayn, qala khadda sana al-Quran. Al-Quran should be considered correct and right or that is null and right. For example, somebody, he was walking in heavy rain. In a portion very rarely we see rain. Yes, and here very rarely you see sun. Most of the time there is rain. So if there is a heavy rain, you are walking from Muslim to your house and your house is on a distance. 
and the heavy rain was falling. You are wet from head to toe. Wet from head to toe. The water is thrown on your entire body. Can you say that your body is clear now? Your wudu is automatically done, and you can pray a prayer with it. You cannot answer this question. Do I? The Imam Shah, the Imam Malik, and the Imam Akbar in the Hamad, Rahimahullah, they said they based upon this hadith in the Malamad of India, and with this wash, you didn't intend the wudu. So even though you got a shower accidentally, but still you cannot pray a prayer. Because there was no intention of it. But then they said, that if the rain started helping you, you were without wudu, but you were walking in rain, and you made the intention of wudu. Now wudu is automatically done. So now you should pray. Because the intention is getting. But Imam Bukhari Parahmatullah Ya'ala says, Therefore, also intention is not must, they can be committed. Why? Because there is a physical action. That's what? That is a physical action. And physical action has its result and after effects automatically without intention. Got it? If you drink water without the intention of quenching your thirst, and you drink the full jug, but never had an intention that I am drinking my thirst. Make the asko bidara. So you have not made any intention, but you drink the water. The thirst is not a part of So it means that niya has nothing to do with something which is physical. And say in the case of Budu according to Imam al Khalifa, Rahmatullah Ale. Now the other thing is that we are the intention strains now. What do you think if we will speak under 10 o'clock? You are ready to sit up, huh? Oh, yes. this is not good. These students of mine who came with me all the way here, they are mostly born here, most of them, they are born here. They are educated here. But until midnight, they are sitting here and They never said that in a visit. Yes, but we are saturated now. But I think you people are too saturated. So that's why you cannot say far more than one hour or so. So anyhow, my dear respected brother and sister in Islam, take my word in life mode. Don't be unhappy. Because I don't have any other relation with you people. The only relation of me and you is La ilaha illallah. Say, Muhammad Rasulullah. And I think that this friendship and relation they get stronger than any other nation. And that's why if a white Muslim will come here, or a black Muslim will come here, a gray or a brown Muslim will come here, so we turn our face from him that he is not from our complexion, from our taste, from our color, or if he is a new one, so we will come and say, Why? What is my relation with this person? And that is the beauty of Islam. Today, in Philadelphia and Madrasa, in my speech I said that I went to San Diego, his friends of mine, they were with me. So he went to San Diego, they are our friends. They have, they had been in a rented place as a Muslim, but they were looking for some permanent building as you have one. So they got a building that is a double story building. Double story building. But their double story building had four churches. This one is Korean church. This one is African church. This one is white church. And this one is second sex church. Different sex. Because they are not going to be churches of one another. You know what I am saying? But is there any concept of in Islam that this one did belong to white Muslims or they cannot come? Or uh, this one belong to African Muslims or not African cannot come? Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala says, Ya Ibn Nas, Inna khalaqnakum min zakarun wa unsa, wa ja'alnakum shu'ubun wa qaba'ila lita harafu, inna akrabakum indallahi wa qaba'ila. Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala 
So 
maioria dos cartabalas é sistema de Islam, ainda na Ramada de Miliyat. O ainda na Ramada de Manawa. Só o Imam Shafi, o Imam Malik, o Imam Ahmad, o Imam Hamad, o Imam Zafé. E essa é o Imam Hanifa, o Imam Shafi. He is the one who 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 is the Study one book or two books or three books or whatever. If somebody can memorize all the books of medicine, if not if he has not gone through the proper procedure of becoming an MP and MBBS, you will consider him a doctor. No. Say no. You will ask him for a prescription. No. You will lay down on stage in front of him to get your belly and to do a surgery. If you will do in front of such a guy, so we have to take you to St. Royal. But I am in the idea. But I don't know why we are not that much careful about our deen. Because deen does not have that much value in our eyes. For example, our prayer, the way we pray, one of my country, he was very sick. He was sitting in Russia and they must be is in our village, in our town, in the, we call it bazaar, in the bazaar. So the people are coming and praying, coming to bazaar and praying, and Jamaah is done, but people are coming, Allah, 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 Allah. So he lost his temper. He said that Allah is Allah. For sure he is Kareem. For sure he is Kareem. He will accept these prayers also. Otherwise I will not purchase all these prayers for one thing. Because we think this is a burden, or this is a duty, just get rid of this as soon as possible. If you are not performing your ibadah with fully love with Allah, so there is no need of such an ibadah. Because the ibadah and the worship that has been defined by our Allah, by the Sultan, may not be hope. Lillah Azza wa Jal, in the Mutabah of the Lord. غاية الظلم من غاية الحب لله عز وجل في متابعة النبي صلى الله عليه وسلم فور كونتنتس فور كونتنتس نمبر وان اتموست هيوميليشن ار همبرنس ان فرانك الله غاية الظلم انت وات ات مينز يو ار سيندينج لايك ذس بوتينج يور هاندز هير ار هير If somebody is putting here, that is sunnah. If somebody is putting here, that is sunnah. But based upon the tahkik of his imam, because he is not a man of that caliber to decide on the floor. You know what I'm saying? He must have a source. That is from the Quran. You know what I'm saying? So, one of our teachers, from Jami Azhar, he was telling us a story. Because if you will go to Arab world, so you will find here the follow of almost every Imam in one city. There are some people they are following Imam Ali, some of them they are following Imam Ali Muhammad, or Imam Shafi, or Imam Ali Muhammad. So he said that one Hanafi, he was praying. And in the Hanafi, we are putting our hands here. So there was one follower of Imam Shafi, but a foolish guy. Yes. So he was thinking that this is wrong. So he came here and he said, that, "Brother, your prayer is wrong. Put it here." So he put it here. And then in every time, every time, most of the people they follow him, Malik and Abdullah. So he said that another Malik he was sitting here. He was also the same nature. So he came and he said, "We both are wrong. Just keep it here." Yes. Now the guy.
when he finished his prayer, he came to these three people. He said that, I know that there is this one who practices of the Prophet sometime. This one who practices of the Prophet sometime. This one who practices of the Prophet sometime. When I was practicing the practice of the Prophet sometime, you were not leaving me alone when I invented my own, so you got satisfied and you were saying, yes. You're either one of me. So, my dear respected brother and sister of Islam, in So now the three Imams, they say they the correction are the validity of every action is based upon intention. But Imam Abu Hanifa says, no, these differ from these. These, so he says, Af'ali Ma'aniya in Af'ali Hissiya. Af'ali Hissiya is physical deeds like this. I give you the example to our body was lost. He said, for its validity, the intention is not needed. If you make your wudu only the the to cool down your temperature, but you wash your organs in the same way a Muslim is washing for prayer, the wudu way. But your intention was not that of wudu, but you were feeling some temperature, so that's why you did that practice. So now, according to three months, he cannot pray a prayer with because there was no intention of wudu. And Baba Khalifa Abdullah, and practically the wudu is done. So when that is done, he can pray with the yes. The only difference is that if you will make intention for wudu, so you will be getting the reward. If without intention the wudu is done, prayer will be made based upon the wudu. But for wudu you are not getting the reward. Because the reward is based upon intention. You are getting it or not? And Imam Muhammad Rahmatullahi Alayhi He is referring to a way of saying that Wuray Razi Allah Ta'ala Rasulullah Sallallahu Alaihi Wasallam was asked by his Sahaba Wa kifa ta'rifu ummata ta yawm al-qiyamah Ibn Bain Isaibin Umami Ya Rasulullah How many people will be there standing in front of Allah on the day of judgment for their accountability? Do you know the number? Anybody who knows the number? Brilliant and zillions of people we don't know for how long this world is going on and all the humans. There will be Muslim and there will be Kafir, there will be Muslim and there will be Wahid, there will be Buddha and there will be Bay. So trillions and zillions of humans will be standing in front of Allah for their accountability. So Sahaba asked the Prophet Sallallahu Alaihi Wasallam, Ya Rasulullah, how you will recognize and know your Ummah amongst all these people. So Rasulullah Sallallahu Alaihi Wasallam said, Look, look at my here. Look, not wudu, not wudu, that is the action you are doing. And wudu is that water which is used for the world. And that is the preferred revival. Um Guru Muhajjadun Amin Afari Wadu. That they will be shining like the full moon their organs because of the water of Wadu. The water of Wadu. Now look at me. For Wadu. Do you know the Wadu, the Arba'a and the Lirita face? Because washing face, that is for us. Washing your hands, that is for us. Touching your head, for us. Washing your feet. And all other are either sunan or mustahabba, there is no wajib in Wudu. Wajib is not there in Wudu. There are three things only. For us, sunan or mustahab. Got it? So, four for us, the card is going to be fine. They come up with I have to open my mind. Yeah, you know, the dinner, I'm going to be the one to be the one. وَمُسِلُوهُمْ تُحَرْكُمْ وَإِذِيَكُمْ إِلَى الْمَرَافِقِ وَمُسَقُمْ بِرُقُوسِكُمْ وَأَرْجُوَكُمْ إِلَى الْكَعْدِينَ They call you who believe when you are going for prayer 
to start your prayer, enter into your prayer. But you do what you have. So wash your dress. Wa aqiyakum ila al-marafiq. And wash your hands up to your elbows. Wa sa'udhi wa musiru. And touch with wet hand your head. Wa aqiyakum ila al-marafiq. And wash your feet up to your ankles. Now this is another thing. Their elbows are included or not included. The ankles are included, don't, don't, don't jump. This is not very easy at all. Imam Zufar ibn Hussain rahmatullahi alayhi wa great fati. And the elder student of Imam Abu Hanifa, he said that elbows are not included. And the ankles are not included. He said that Ela, Ela, he called it Baya. He said that Baya is outside of the Ya. And why he said it? Because Allah says, Summa Ati Masiyama, in the day of the year, he said, Ela al Marafi. Here he said, Ela al Kabe. They are regarded first, Allah says, Ela al Layl. Let them complete your fasting, Ela al Layl, tonight. What? Tonight, what? Say, tonight. Yeah, so night is included in fasting? Say, you fast at night time also? The moment the night saw in Hadith Rasulullah sallallahu alayhi wa sallam says, Reza akbar al-layl min haahuna, wa akbar al-naharu min haahuna, faqad akbar al-sahir. That when you see the night appear here from the east, and you say, you see, the day is setting down into the west. So Rasulullah says, I'm saying that we climb up in the heart. Just go ahead and do your job. So it means the night is not included. So they say, Ilal Ali, Ilal Marafit, Ilal Kaabin. So Imam Zubar says, either you should kill that kila or this kila. And every Imam Muhammad has to say, Amen. None of them has ever said a single word from their own. Because they are not shari, they are not sharia giver. Sharia giver is only Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala. He gave the sharia directly to whom? To the Rasulullah sallallahu alayhi wa sallam. Now look, the parliament, what? The parliament, the Congress and the Senate, they formulate a great Allah. Yes. They accept it with majority. Then they send it to the president for final sign. Yes? A lot. Now that has become a law and act. That's not what? Act. That has become an act. When with the signature of the president, they became an act. So now the attorneys who are here, you know the superior courts are not. You know the courts are not. The courts are here. Yes, so in course, you know that don't be the You don't know that one? I have not seen such a city anywhere out of the world that where their course are and they are done in Nigeria. How do you contest your guess? So I don't think that's it. Now I tell me is not your or he is not in the record. Okay. He is not in the record. I tell me is not giving law. I have been told by the parliament with you to sign up the pension. That is, that is an act. No, judge is not interested in the party. Judge is making his mind to the interpretation of the terms. I am a dummy for that fine. I can give the if you can tell. Yeah? You sit without me. So anyhow, my dear respected brothers and sisters in Islam, now these imams, they are not the dark They only interpret. And why only they interpret it? Because Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala present with those qualities which are required. Like if the attorney had been blessed by the law college for their interpretation, and that's why he's charging you for ten thousand dollars. And they said to everyone, every attorney is saying to his client that you win. Yes. From the very beginning, the attorney they said to his client that you not win. Oh, my God, the attorney. Then he has 
that is come and go home. So anyhow, my dear respected brothers and sisters in Islam, Inna Alamari Bin Niyad, so I was referring to Let me mind and do a kiss. Date. At that time, Rasulullah sallallahu alayhi wa sallam, my favorite from Makkah to Medina. So at that time, their Hijra was first. And therefore, the Muhajirin Sahaba in Abyssinia, they were in good state there. Because of legacy, the Christian king there still was an ice cream by nature. And that's why he accepted Islam. That's why he So 
So they told him that any time in the time of prayer he is in Muslim. Openly he is meeting people and people are meeting him. He said, but I am in hurry. And this is a long day under Salat al I want to meet him as soon as possible. So they said that now we saw him. He was walking on this street. Maybe in direction to some problem he was going there. So he said, with protocol, he said, what do you mean protocol? He said, like the motorcycle and food, you know, you want to buy the car and front end, and this and this and that. He said, we want to use that problem. He was alone, he was going somewhere. He said, they can you drive me there? He said, that this is somebody asking for some issue. So when you will go to the left side path you were there, you will see him somewhere. When he went that path, he saw him from the name of Yabra He was laying on the open ground and dirt, having a stone under his head. And he was He went here, hi, by whatever his meeting was. He did it. He said, over to Makan, he said, he said, that's why our emperor is sitting here in Rome and when you are making attention to his heart, you make Because you don't have any fear of anybody else. You have the fear of Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala. And Rasulullah sallallahu alayhi wa sallam said in the hadith, like a kind of how funny if you tell it at the moment, in the heart of more than two fears will never get together. This heart is only one part, it will accommodate for the human being. Either the fear of creature or the fear of the creation. So if someone has the fear of now look poverty, that is creator or that is creature? Creation. If somebody is afraid of poverty, so at least it is not only fear of Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala. It is not only fear of Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala and Allah wa Razaq wa Kuwa Jimati. That is Razaq and He is the provider. Otherwise, two fears, why would they get together in the heart of the moment? So anyhow, to make the long story short, Sahaba Rabbullah al they are not mentioning the name of their Sahabi. Who they get to Medina in connection to their trip. The lady name was Ummu Qais. Lady name was Ummu Qais. So Sahaba, Sayyidina Abu Hurairah says, that in our society, as a joke, in life mode, we use to call them when we are the Muhajirin of Kandani and the Muhajirin of Mekes. So now in connection to me and him, he is the Muhajir of Dharara and the Muhajir of my wife. Wa Abdullahana Alhamdulillah Al-Qalalami Alhamdulillah Al-Qalalami Wa Salatu wa Salam wa Rasulim Wa Salatu wa Salam wa Rasulim Wa Salatu wa Salam wa Rasulim Allah wa Rabbana Asil Aqibatana Abil Mubur Kulli Hawa Jalna Min Tim Jumnya Wa Zabir Akhira Rabbana Abilna Wa Latuhina Wa Atamna Wa Latuhina Wa Alayna Allah wa Rabbana Hathina Wa Hathina Wa Hathina Wa Hathina Wa Hathina Wa in this budget, in connection to listen to the Deen of Allah and the Quran and Sunnah Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala except they're sitting. Except they're listening as well. Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala grant them their needs and remove their mashakil and their difficulty. Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala give us the free to perform our duty as Muslim in the proper way and to practice accordingly the light of Quran and Sunnah. The Sallallahu wa ta'ala Thank you for everyone to come to this and to Just remember, November 19, we have an annual foundation program, inshallah, right here in the IGA. And inshallah, the transmission will be 805, inshallah, today. 805. And after that, we are going to have a dinner, inshallah. So, if you are going to go to the good, not to go to the good, not to go to
stop it? Yeah.